the less I'm able to differentiate their colors. Forbidden is back. Ah, uh, I did come in that blaster. Okay, so we gotta get up out of here. We all got something to do. There's something with the thing. Something within. Something within. Something. Yeah. I need a compass when I got a compass at the top of my screen. Y'all like how? Huh? Incoming! Like how I in there. If we going up against the board, why do I care about what the board has to say? Just a thought, you know? Simple thought. Something Listen, I am not trying to sit here and hurt nobody, bruh. <laughs> I ain't trying to. I ain't trying to hurt nobody, bruh. You must. Oh, there. That's one right there. Can't you just see the step? Dang. I had a key, bro. I had a key. The Acropolis District is off limits. Move along. What in the law's name are you on about? Sure. Let me just take that off your hands. Did I say restricted area? Slip of the tongue. What I meant was, <laughs> welcome to the Acropolis District. Thanks. I'm glad I had some money, though. Sure. <sighs> I, knew I knew it was all. Ah, no. Hey, Captain, I stand out here like a big, greasy Welcome thumb. To the official headquarters of the Halcyon Holdings Corporation Board. Today's greeting is brought to you by Anti Clio, a subsidiary of. Holdings. Is there stairs in him? Uh, it got to be stairs or an elevator, correct? He just let me walk out with my arm. Take your business. Please step away. This entry is for high priority HHC business only. Huh. I didn't realize we were still using those iridescent stickers. But this looks right. I'll just need you to register your weapons with a revised request to carry 32B form. Each weapon will need a separate form. Now, let's see. Damn it. When did I run out of forms? I was gonna suggest that myself. <laughs> Look, you don't have time to wait on new forms. And I can't afford the citations for impeding HAC business. So I'm gonna save us both some trouble and waive your forms. Thanks. 
mighty fine again. Just know there are a bunch of guards upstairs, and they're all high on dervish mist and low on patience. So try anything funny, and they'll paint the walls with your guts. Yeah, the other place tried that too. But alright, I'll be on my best behavior. I think I, I can't promise what I think. You goofy goober. I'm glad I got you out of that nutshell, because of sweetheart. Apologies for the wait. I was arranging my stationery. Personal assistant to Adjutant Akande and Chairman Rockwell. I'm also responsible for organizing the Adjutant's stationery. Which is, which is more of a hobby. Ah! Oh, you were being serious. I'm obliged to inform you that Chairman Rockwell is unavailable for an indeterminate duration. Oh my god. Will there be anything else? A UDL security attendant is always prepared. Nothing exciting ever happens around here. Bruh, really? Excuse me, just a moment. You could dismantle a single room of this place, sell the materials and feed... Good afternoon. I'm Chairman Rockwell. And I'm here to address a serious issue facing us. As you all know, our colony has been successful beyond our wildest dreams. Unfortunately, we've recently discovered that our food supply will not be able to sustain Halcyon's population in the long term. Everyone will die. Everyone will slowly stop living from malnutrition. But we're doing it together, and that's what matters. I fucking swear, if someone doesn't give me something to read that will placate the masses soon, all of you will find yourselves violently unemployed. But I can assure you there's nothing to fear. We've got a solution. It's called the Lifetime Employment Program. We will freeze most of the colony to preserve resources, while the best and brightest of Byzantium continue living in prosperity. Mm. Look, you idiots! How many times do I have to tell you we can't say shit like that? Fire whoever wrote this! While Halcyon's brightest minds solve the problem of our- Guess the whole colony's up a creek. I thought it was just Monarch. Sounds about right. So, I don't know what the perks we talking about. I beg your pardon, Minister Clark's former office is currently closed to solicitors. I suppose that is admissible. Please try not to break anything. Are we gonna get in trouble today? Not that I want to, just seems to happen around you, is all. That's on account of how I never met her. Oh. 
It's hard to miss what you never knew. I don't ponder it over much. She was in another division of the Spacer's Choice family. She worked in the Vale a few months, sorting the cannery computers. Her contract said any kids she had, expected or not, belonged to her office from the time of conception. It's sensible. Dad just fixed machines. She did some kind of crazy math, high-level stuff. Better to raise me on his time than hers. Like I ain't just break into something. I got perk points again. What am I supposed to do with these? I don't even use that. Oh yeah, I do. I do use the inhaler. So y'all just want to kill off everybody else and keep the high people on board, which y'all are the part of the ones that caused all this in the first place. But we ain't gonna say no names, we ain't gonna state no facts, we just gonna talk for what we think we know. Nope, ain't going in there. This might be tough! I'm out. I'm out. No worries. I'm out. Bring him down! Oh, you should have told me, bro. You're not getting through. <laughs> I'm about to die in this game. Get up! Y'all ain't shoot bad. How you gonna tell me to get up? I ain't know I was supposed to be going there. Maybe I should be like, you know, looking at my mouth and stuff. <laughs> Let me look at my mouth. Could have just did that in the first place, huh? I'm taking out my shoddy on y'all. Like, I got access and y'all just like, mm -mm. shoot him, dude. Trying to save y'all lives, but no, shoot him, dude.
Hey, did Tillman get transferred or something? That's right. You weren't here when it happened. I did everything here. I just need to go in here. Some UDL that. officers took him into custody. Oh, Lord. What is so I got to go down now. Not so fast. The Ministry of Accuracy and Morale is off limits to everyone without X-36 level clearance. Basically, if you don't work here, or for Chairman Rockwell himself, you're not getting in. I don't know how you got that, but I still don't know you, and I don't have any new clearances on the list. What the heck? Am I going the wrong way? I got to be. Oh, my God. 
my gosh, bro. Bro, I'm about to jump down, bro. so easy. Oh, because it was blocked, so I can only come out of it. Gotta get way back over here. No, we can run, right? Here's it's my car. car. I'm running. Y'all better come on. Unexpected. Fight the whole time. No, come on, y'all. Where are you going? Bring him down. Now just please. calm down. I don't want to die. You better move. Stop something. Attack. Get it behind cover. Don't hurt me. <laughs> Everybody mad. Don't want to die. Don't hurt. Oh, man. I don't want to die. Speak to your girl. I don't want to die. I don't want to die. 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 Don't I better come on. Time waits for no man. <laughs> Time waits for no man. Where are we headed today, Captain? The stars are the limit. I know, right? We're gonna get the up out of here. You have a message from Adjutant Sophia Akande. No one ever looks quite the same in person as they do in my reports. And my reports of you have been exceptionally thorough. You've had quite a career. You have something I want. I'd like to negotiate. I'm listening. Phineas Wells is wanted by the board. I want to convince you to turn him in to us. Never.
wanted for what it He has a litany of charges against him. Vandalism, illegal experimentation, sedition. I could go on. Please do. Wells is a dangerous madman. His plan is going to endanger everyone in Halcyon. He's an obsessive psychopath. And he's using you. You're in contact with Wells. I want you to send us a tracing signal from his communication terminal. Don't worry about pay. The board always rewards good work. Wells was our mistake. We failed to apprehend him for years. I'm asking you to help me correct that mistake. I'm sending you my access code. Contact me from Wells' terminal. When you're done, come speak to me in my office. Adjutant Akande's call has been terminated. Will there be anything else, Captain? I'm not doing that. Y'all can't make it. We've arrived at Phineas's orbital lab. Bad. Hey, uh, it seemed like I could have sneezed and made it up. I'm taking her, bro, because you like, oh, we're not going to get in trouble, are we? No. I'm giving that fool, Lord. That fool took me out of my habitat. Hey, Y'all had me stuck in that bit. Giving that man away. in your absence optimized my formula i'm now confident i can revive the remaining colonists all i need now is the dimethyl sulfoxide i'll take as much as you can give me human test subjects oh that's grotesque that's unthinkable that's exactly what i'd expect out of the board Thank you. You've brought me enough chemicals to get started, at least. I'm just sorry they came at the cost of human lives. Those poor people, they must have died in agony. What exactly was the board trying to accomplish? What nonsense! People aren't just slabs of meat the board can freeze and thaw at their convenience. I'll tell you this much. The board scientists are hopelessly lost. After years of fruitless experimentation, they've made exactly zero progress. Mm. I know! I've suspected as much for years. Of course, I don't expect the board to do a thing about it. They've been driving our colony to the brink of destruction for decades. Mm. The board's mismanagement put our colony on the road to collapse. If we don't put a stop to them, thousands of colonists are going to die. Hold on. Let me see if I understand this correctly. Mm -hmm. You're 
you're saying that Halcyon's on the brink of total collapse? And the chairman's plan to save all of us is to save himself? Mm -hmm. I always knew Halcyon was heading toward a system's collapse, but I never imagined we were already there. The board made this crisis, and now they want to solve it by freezing the rest of us? That's not a plan. That's a goddamn escape clause. Mm -hmm. Do you realize what this means all I gotta for, the say hope, for your they don't fellow really care about us. The board's going to kill them all. Toss them out into space just to make room in their hibernation chambers. Short of lining up every member of the board and shooting <laughs> them in the back of the head. One on four here, bro. Do you know what's waiting for us on the Hope? Scientists, engineers, artists, the brightest minds Earth ever sent us, uncorrupted by the board. The board's going to dispose of them all and transform the Hope into a prison for the rest of us. They're likely on their way to the Hope as we speak. We need to get to those colonists before the board. I have enough chemicals to start reviving a few of them, but no easy way to get them off the hope. All right, I've got it. We can't possibly take my lab and all my equipment to the hope, yes? That would be insane, so we do the slightly less insane thing. We bring the hope to us. I knew it. Skip the entire ship across the distance of colony space, right next to my lab. This is crazy, I like it. Just wait until you hear the details. I haven't been this energized since the time I injected myself with raw cavanoid. Mm. If we link up the hope to the unreliable, then use your navigational computer to calculate a reasonably safe vector, we can skip the entire colony ship into the rings of Terra 2. You'll need to switch on the Hope's auxiliary power using the unreliable. Then, head to the bridge. Your navigational computer, Ada, should be able to activate the Hope's skip drive. Once you've skipped the Hope next to my lab, I'll have easy access to the frozen colonists. I can start reviving them immediately. I know you're wondering why I'm doing all this. Why I believe the people on the Hope are the answer to the colony's problems. The Hope is carrying some of humanity's most brilliant thinkers. Scientists, engineers, experts in their field. If we work together, we can still find a way to save Halcyon. The board would have us believe Halcyon is beyond saving. I choose to believe otherwise. If there's even the slightest chance we can save Halcyon from oblivion, then we have to take it. Yeah, poor. Okay, I can plant a dragon on it for my I'm not gonna do it. You absolutely should. What? The adjutant must have sent you some kind of tracking code. If you don't use the code, she'll suspect you betrayed her. I think you should use the code and send a corrupted tracking signal. Mm. That should buy me some time. I bet. You sure you're okay with this? The enemy is bound to discover my hideout sooner or later. I'm prepared for that eventuality. This is just my way of buying myself a little time. Use my communications terminal to corrupt the tracking signal. While the board busies themselves trying to decipher it, I'll have plenty of time to prepare my defenses. Right. 